welcome back to my channel it's Carrie so today I'm gonna to be doing a what's on my iPhone video so I have the iPhone 5s phone with this cute little case that says hello hello I oh, don't know it's just cute um, so yeah we're just gonna be seeing what's on my phone so yeah let's get into it so when I first turn on my phone I have the wallpaper that comes with any Apple device it's just this purple flower so I slide to unlock it. I don't have the little touch thing because I just need to get on my phone fast when I'm receiving text messages at work or whatnot. So I just have all my apps on one page just to make it nice and simple. Once again, I have that background that comes with the Apple phones. So I have, first one is the phone, obviously. I have my like main four common things that I use a lot, like not in a little folder so I can just get to them quickly. So. I have my phone app music. I don't have that much music on it because I, I just got since I got my new computer I had to re-download all this music so I don't have that much on right now. I need to download more that's for sure. I only have 22. So yeah I have my music and then I have my camera, my photos. I have like 600 and something photos. Not too many. I try to delete ones that I don't like or I don't use that often or if it's just lots of duplicates of others so yeah I just delete them. And my first one I like to have my little folders I don't use names I use emojis I think it looks really cute so I have the clock one for this because I have the clock in here and then I have my calendar FaceTime contacts so I try to put similar ones in each folder then I have a little sun for this to represent the weather and I have maps in here my notes reminders and videos and also my reminders keeps telling me I have two reminders when it clearly is nothing in here so I don't understand why it keeps saying there's two if anyone knows the answer please comment down below because it's driving me crazy the next one I have it's a little iPhone emoji just for like iPhone apps I guess so I have the App Store, iTunes Store, my settings, books, health, podcasts, and tips these are all the ones that won't delete and so then I go to general let's go to about see what's on here songs 22 that's so sad I need to get some more videos 28 photos 600 oh I thought I had more than that so let's include videos then. I only have 15 apps and I have 5 gigabytes available. Awesome sauce. And so then go to the next folder and it just has the little folder emoji. This is like all useless ones that I don't use that often. And so there's the calculator, compass, voice memos, stocks, passbook, newsstand, game center, my emoji key and that Apple Watch thing. Does anyone else find it annoying with the new update? They put on this Apple Watch thing so if you have an Apple Watch it can connect onto your phone but it won't let you delete it so it's going to be on your phone forever. I wonder if you're not getting an Apple Watch so why do you have to have it on here? I don't know it just really bothers me. And then in my next folder it's a little mail thing so this is all my common like not super social media but just my common one. So I have my Safari, my mail, banking, YouTube, yeah. Oh, I was watching Megan, Megan Rinkets. I really don't want to, I totally pronounced that wrong, I feel. That's embarrassing. Bam, bam, bam. Checking out my channel to see if any more people watch my videos. So, yeah, it's just, I like to check that, like, daily to make sure I'm going up at least. <clears throat> And then I also have Netflix on here. Gotta live, can't live without my Netflix. It's not all of my Apple devices. And my last one, it just have these like, I guess it's like face, like two people. I don't know. I probably should change it because it's kind of blah. So this is like my social media ones. I don't have all of my social media on here because I try not to go on my phone that often. So if I ever want to go on Pinterest or, um, Twitter and stuff I use my computer so that I'm not on my phone like constantly checking them on but these are like my main ones so I have Instagram Facebook the hunt I like to go on the hunt just to check out some cool outfits eight tracks I'm in love in love with eight tracks if you guys haven't checked it out you must go check it out <clears throat> it's like songs uh 
kinda. So you can go to explore and choose any theme. So chill, indie, and then it has all these different playlists. And it's just so, so amazing. I love a tracks I have the Facebook Messenger, Etsy, Pinterest. Oh, I guess I do have Pinterest on here. Whoops. Um, Visco Cam, for, really good for editing photos. I love using that. And Mauled Viv. I use this to make collages and stuff and put my photos all together. So yeah, you, there's a whole bunch you can choose from. It's one of my favorite ones to stitch pictures together. And I just have one more. I only have one game on my phone because, once again, I try not to spend so much time on my phone. So the only game I have is Solitaire, and I'm in love with Solitaire. I play it whenever I'm bored or if it's like a good mind game. I love Solitaire, my favorite one. <laughs> and then that's all for my little folders. So at the bottom, I just have my two main ones that I use all the time, Messages and Tumblr. I love, love, love Tumblr. So... Those are my two main ones that go on all the time. If you haven't followed me on Tumblr, go check it out. My name is just Carrie Nicole V. So yeah, just go check out my Tumblr. It's so cool. But yeah, those are my main ones that I use. And that is what's on my iPhone. And I guess I have that iPhone 5S in gold. And I have this really cute case. Like I said in the intro, I love it. It's so cute. And I got it from Winners for only like $9, and it was originally $35. Like, honestly, who would pay $35 for this kind of phone case? But yeah, I'm super happy I found it on sale, so that's awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if we have the same apps on our phone. That would be really cool. And make sure you subscribe to my channel so you never miss out on a video. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye!